Ah, uh, well, that was a halfway decent attempt at a uh, melodic major um, melody or lead. Um, I'm in the key of D, D major, and the box I'm using is right here. <laughs> Except what I'm doing there, which it, it works really well. It's worked a lot well for a lot of people. I've seen Neil Sean do it, Steve Lukather, and of course Dickie Betts is in that scale. I'm eliminating my seventh. It's kind of what he does in Blue Sky, Dickie Betts. It just, it, I'm not sure why at this time, but that seventh kind of just throws it off a lot. I mean, you can still use it occasionally. Anyway, and uh, like I said, I've seen Steve Lukather do it a lot. I've seen Neil Scon do this a lot. Even Alex Lifeson, before he got all fancy schnancy, um, which, you know, he's still awesome. He used to do a lot of early leads like that, kind of bass like that. Um, Free will, fly by night. Anyway, I'm staying. Okay, I'm using D, and let's say just like pull some random scale, uh, rhythm out of my hat. And here I am in this, which is you know D pentatonic. And what I'll do is, if I'm in D, there's my other D. Above it's my fifth. Which of course is A. And after each little scale, each little run, Turn to that that tonal center there and resolve on it. Every once in a while, when it sounds like it's getting resolved too much on that, and your mind's starting to say, "There's that note again," then I'll switch to the fifth. And at the end, I do that little pedal tone. just you know the way I've seen them approach you know a lot of the more melodic guitarists approach that 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 type of I don't know if you call it happy-go-lucky upbeat rock but it's pretty much where the guys played anyway it's been a shorter lesson and I just want to say apologize to you guys the microphone I use for these lessons is extremely sensitive otherwise it phases out background noises and it picks up every little noise so I'm sure you guys have noticed that every little grunt and every little uh, thing like that, you hear a little bit. And I have to apologize. I'm working on that. It can be distracting, as is distracting to me. And but trust me, I'm not doing it loud. It's just it picks it up. Anyway, thanks a lot. See you next lesson.